It's all your fault! It's an awesome game. It's all your goddamn fault! Yeah, because it's an awesome game. It is not! I am gonna fucking hate this! I don't know why you're having a problem. This is a good game. <sighs> Welcome, everybody, to Let's Suffer. This is where I play games that I absolutely despise just so that you can all have fun watching me suffer through them. We should get around to playing Professor Layton at some point, then. Absolutely motherfucking not! Also, I have no medium for it. I'll give you that one. Yeah. Wait, are you going to provide me a medium? No, I mean, I I'll give you that you don't have a medium for it. Okay, fine. The second you buy me a medium, I'll think about it. Until then, it's just fucking game this fucking crap. <sighs> I can't wait until we get to Ribbon, because that's not one of, uh, that's one I've not actually played. Shut it! Now I'm going to be clear, people. I don't hate Mist. At least, I don't hate the game itself. I just hate what it does to me. I'm not a puzzle person. I'm not good at puzzles. So, being in this game, playing it, is just going to be torture for me. And maybe for you people, because you're going to see how really, really stupid I am. And I'm not going to help you at all. And just remember, everybody... When you hate this series, and when you hate this game as much as I do, you know who to blame. Oh, they don't have to suffer through it quite as much as you. You can fast forward some of their pain. When you're I sitting there for two have... hours staring at a wall, not understanding what you're supposed to do, they can get that in a couple of seconds. I'll have a very long talk with the editor. They will feel my pain. I was talking to the editor. Well, the part where you can fast forward it. Does what I tell him to do. <sighs> On one end, at least I'm glad this is real mist and not classic mist, where you have to fucking click everywhere. Yeah, except there's less places for you to explore in real mist, or in the original mist. Well, then that just means there's more places for us at off. Let's just get this fucking over with! Well, how quickly do you want to get it over with? As quick as humanly possible. Hey, there's a letter on the floor. On the grass. To the right of the, the, the pathway. Oh. Ah. Walk up the stairs. <clears throat> Catherine, I've left for you a message of utmost importance in the foyer chamber beside the dock. Enter the number of marker switches on this island into the image to retrieve the message. In the imager to retrieve the message. Yours, Atris. So, what's a marker switch? You know what a marker switch is. Yes, I do. I'm asking if you know. Why would I know what a marker switch is? Because I don't want to give you the answers. That takes all the fun out of a puzzle game. It has been like a billion years since I played this godforsaken thing. So, figure it out. <laughs> figure it out. Have intellect. I know that's not something that's natural to you, but figure it out. You can see one right where you're standing. Wait, right where I'm standing, so... Standing here, facing here. Building, building. Building, building thingy. Uh, so, power line thingy, it looks like. What the fuck else is there? Why don't you try clicking on things? Things? Because I have to walk up to things to click on them. 
Didn't click here. This thing? Well, what does it do? Nothing. But it has a switch on it, does it not? A switch that does nothing. So it's a switch that is simply a location marker? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, what was the net last number I said? Eight. Yep. Counted that one, yes? I believe so. Eight. That's that's yeah. all I got. Eight. I'm coming up with eight too. Says the guy said he wasn't gonna help me. Well, I said I wasn't gonna find you answers. Hologram. Didn't he say it was a hologram? This is the imager. Oh, he said it was an imager, right? Would you enter a number on that little button anyway? Well, that's all I've got. I got two buttons. Unless there's something else in the room? There aren't even doors on this room. Well, there are numbers here. Yeah, but how could you switch. enter those? Those are note numbers. Isn't there a little green button in the top corner of that? Questions. Right, that's I think what the message is supposed to do. Who's Catherine? Who's that? Who's Cirrus? Who's Atlas? Aknar. Aknar. Where are the books? Why are they important? Why do we use them? How do you use them? No, I'm missing something. Well, there was a book when you started the game where it had a moving picture that you touched and it brought you to this island. Maybe that's how the other books work? 
Yeah, while I was existing in the fucking negative zone. Yeah. My question more is, what's the tower of rotation? What are the places of protection? What are the keys he was referring to? <sighs> tower of rotation. Well, obviously, it's a tower that rotates. What tower? Have we seen any towers on this island yet? Are there even any towers on this island? I haven't taken a good look around. They're too busy being mad about being here. That's a tower. Alright, how do we get to that tower? Cave. Cave. It looks like that building is the only way to get even close to that mountain. I was standing beside the mountain. Okay, fair enough. Looks like that building is the only way to get closer. That mountain looks like it has some sort of a extension into the back of that building, almost. It would be led to believe it would be here. Behind the bookshelf. So, obvious solution is pull at random books and see which one opens the magic door? That's a lot of books to pull. Yeah, but I can see five that are distinctly different. That was... Uh... Okay... Next time, I'll be done pulling all these books.